Nossa, mano. Que game assustador, mano. Doutor Octares. Então vamos lá, galera. Sejam todos bem-vindos a mais uma saga da Hora do Espanto no canal Rodrigo Baltar. O canal que mais cresce no Brasil. Já vai se inscrevendo no canal se você estiver no YouTube. Se estiver no Twitch, larga o Prime para ajudar. Dá uma olhada nos nossos patrocinadores nos links da descrição. Consoles da nova geração, também nos links da descrição. E vamos lá para mais uma saga aterrorizante. Jogar sozinho. Man of Madden. Buster, we better mosey on back to the ship. Whoa. Stop the presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. Let's have it. What's in store for me, Pop? You do it, Jay, Pai. Yo, he won, ma. Vamos lá, curiosidade. Fale sobre meu filho. Ou vou ficar rico? Uh, I guess I just want to know about my son. Will he, uh. Is he gonna grow up all right? Things gonna work out for him. Caralho. Use R para escolher. Kanjang RT It It looks like a fish? Need a saifu. Kunung lights a zhen her fang xiang. Then she don't take on a fung tree lie. Swang her yun. Death? Wait, what? What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? What the hell, man? Hey, bud, let me get a go at it. Oh, yeah? Think you got the stuff? Fight? Sure. Let me know the quarter. I'm gonna start a tab. I'll give it a whirl. Caralho, use R para melhar, para mirar e RT para socar.
你说你可以搏斗。Tá tudo trocado os botões aqui. Tá aparecendo os botões do Xbox. Eu tô jogando no controle do PlayStation. Tá funcionando beleza aí? Tá alto pra caralho aqui. Thiago Eagle Olha pelo Prime, cara Cara, legal o filme, mano A parada Para o papai. Volte logo. Maio de 47.
Nossa, mano. Não, tá bonita a parada, né? Ainda mais rodando em 8K, né, cara? <risos> Ainda mais rodando em 8K e Tracer. Howdy, Charlie. How's your time off? Just get me out of here already. What the hell is going on up there? I heard aircraft. And gunfire. Me too. And there was a... a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. Vamos lá. O soldado Charles Anderson, da licença, demonstrou o nível de intoxicação incompatível com a conduta esperada de um membro do exército dos Estados Unidos. O soldado Anderson estava envolvido em uma briga de bêbado com outro soldado. Na opinião do oficial responsável pela prisão, isso teria levado à desordem generalizada. Foram tomadas medidas necessárias para que ambos voltassem ao navio. Dez dias de prisão. Aprovado. Semana vinte e sete. Segunda-feira. Arthur Miller. Furto. Um dia de prisão. Pequenos itens pertencentes a um oficial veterano encontrados no armário de Miller. Itens recuperados e devolvidos ao dono. Quarta-feira. David Davis. Intrusão e dois dias na prisão. Encontrado na área proibida. Porão de carga 3A. Sem razão para estar lá. Desprezo flagrante por ordens. Sexta-feira. Cabo Lois Brand. Intoxicação pública. Um dia de prisão, encontrado bêbado e agindo de forma imprópria para um membro do exército americano durante é, licença para desembarcar. Robert Reed, intoxicação pública. Um dia de prisão, encontrado bêbado e agindo de forma inapropriada para um membro do exército americano durante é, licença para desembarcar. Sábado, beleza. É, agora eu tô apertando B, voltar, não tá voltando. Qual tá voltando é o R2. Tem sangue aqui, ó. Agora voltou o... o B, né? O bola. Caralho. Nossa, mano. Caralho, o A. O que eu faço? Pressione o A no ritmo dos batimentos cardíacos. Caralho, fodeu.
Nossa, mano. Vira em Prime aí, mano. Ai, caralho, filha da puta. Tô meio susto. Pressiona repetitivamente para abrir. Fuck no. Yeah, you said it. Fubar and that song. Os moleques são meio pregão, né? God damn, another stiff? Who's the lucky winner? Oh, damn it, Buckley! Last time I saw him in the mess hall, he was fit as a fiddle. Poor fucker. Segure LB para andar mais rápido. So, uh, is it just me or are you getting a real strange feeling right now? Do I look like a guy who likes to talk about his feelings? Os são meio pregão mesmo, né? Ai caralho, filha da puta, eu tomei um susto novo. Você viu aquele homem lá? Não? Você está se sentindo bem? Um porra de susto é foda. Eu já vou ficar te dando um monte de susto.
Come here. Oh, God, no. Charlie! Som 3D do X. Caralho, é um poltergeist, mano. Mayday! Mayday! Is anyone there? Hello! Can anyone out there hear me? Oh, come on! Come on, damn it! Ih, fodeu o poltergeist. Isso deve ser tipo um prólogo, né? Deve ser tipo um prólogo. Nossa, mano. O cara mostrou a cruz de Jesus Christ. Zerei, eu acho. Platina. Valeu, Kawanovski. Seis meses, cara. Hello. And welcome to my repository. O som tá bom, galera?
I am the curator, the curator of stories, stories of love and hate, greed and beauty, life and death, stories such as this one. I'm here to record the story you choose to tell. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish or whether they are snuffed out. You see, we each make decisions according to our own moral compass, and we have to live with those decisions or die by them. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, after all, inevitable. It is the tax one pays for having lived, and it comes, eventually, to everybody. Still, none of us want for it to come too soon, do we? As in life, the actions you take matter. The choices you make will affect others. I'll be keeping a close eye on your progress. It's not my place to interfere, but I might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint. Here's one for free. There are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. If you can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better decisions. Or should I say, decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. That's all for the moment. We'll talk again soon enough. We'll have the opportunity to account for all the actions that you've taken, or whatever mess you've made. Awesome. Deve ser um monte de jovem vagabundo que vai lá caçar tesouro. Aí, Brad, espirituoso irmão do Alex e inocente. Alex, irmão do Brad e namorado de Julia. Inseguro. Acho que temos tempo? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water? Diving? Or maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah? I mean, are you serious you came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kind of, yeah. Caralho. Ficar em silêncio. Ressentimento inseguro. Yeah. It's what? It's embarrassing taking the Valeu, Vitor Reis. Sete meses, cara. Whoa, careful. That dive cam is like super expensive. Bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded. So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Acusador, ficar em silêncio. Dude, you know I'm not like the best around new people, whatever. Just shut up. You gotta loosen up. Oh, come on. Just say yeah to everything on this trip. Wait. Trust me. I want you to have a good time. Okay. Well, what if somebody asks me to do something stupid, like run around naked or something? Metaphorically, just go with it. All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Ooh. Sorry I'm a little snappy. I'm just... We knew medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. Cynismo, empatia. It's been like two weeks. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah, I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Característica atualizada. 
Hey. So, uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Sentimental. You sure you're ready? Give it some thought. Consider all the permutations. Hey! Julia! Empolgada, irmã de Conrad. Namorada de Alex. Ih, caralho! Esse maluco é quanto o break. Eu acho que entrou ele porque eu botei da 1.200 história. Aí veio com ele, que é da Microsoft. Tranquilidade. Yeah. Cool. Tight. I I love beer. Right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. It's Jim. Don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Fúnebre, nunca. Um, no, actually, never done it before. Water virgin, nice. Hey, we're gonna pop your cherry together. We're gonna be gentle. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> But where's the old crust bucket skipper anyhow? Fliss, impaciente, capitã do Duke of Milan, corajosa. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but uh So is everybody on board and ready to go? Caralho. Mulher cara é poderadona, mano. Uh, you're selling, I'm buying. Essa mulher aí que chegou cheia de marra vai ser a primeira que eu vou matar. You uh, wanna go lie down? Yeah. You know maybe I should. Yeah. Oh boy. Muito marrento. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. Brad fez o dever de casa. Brad did his homework. If he says the wreck's here, it's here. <laughs> okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Feast your eyes on this. Caraca, um avião. We're right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Fliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Quem se importa? Ah, ficou em silêncio, cara. Guys, no one knows, no one cares. No harm, no foul. The right way. 
Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine? Untouched? Ah, não, até que ela não é tão babaca, não, a mulher, né? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Right -o. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Caraca, o boneco parece até o Time Comando, lembra? Quem jogou Time Comando, mano? Que era aquilo aí? Era só um glitch mesmo, né? Ah, não. Hey, hey. Hey, sweetie. E o maluco deve estar lá embaixo, ó. What's up? How you doing? Sorry, that Bruski got the better of me. All part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. Took more than that just to screw up the trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. Sure, Julia left anything on the mainland. This only smelled as good as it cost. At least it made her happy. Shroud. Caralho, deve ser muito doido. Eu nunca entrei numa lancha assim, não. Mas deve ser muito doido. Já pensou? Tu tá aqui, tipo, tipo Neymar e Bruna Marquezine, né? Tá só os dois aqui na dentro da lancha. Pô, o que que tá acontecendo lá fora? Às vezes tá virando tempo, vindo um temporal, tem tubarão. Sei lá, sinistra, né? É, foi arrumar um medão. De ficar aqui sem olhar o que tem lá fora. Valeu, Dante! Nove meses, cara. Sharknado, é. Sharkwiz também. Pode aparecer um Sharkwiz aqui. Não, até agora eu achei os personagens meio merdão. Volta lá, o lesado. Premonição desbloqueada. Encalhados. Porra, cara. Pro outro lado, cara.
Troféu City do Boys. Qualified Driver Instruction. É. É. Mergulhadora diplomada. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Perdão por mais cedo. Provocador. Pagamos muito por isso. Fliss, we paid a lot of money for this particular dive. In this particular spot. Every time I take a group of you people out, it's the same thing. No regard for anyone else's customs. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? Eu tenho muitos mergulhos. Dived a couple wrecks over the years. Not an expert, but you know, experienced. If this is your first unreported wreck, then you should know there's a very specific protocol you have to follow. For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. É... Come on. You see anyone else out here? Who's gonna know? We logged our route at the harbor. If someone sees it's been disturbed, it ain't gonna be hard to put two and two together. Especially if some little souvenirs show up online. <laughs> Valeu aí, cara. Pro Psycho Sub. Deu três inscrições de presente, Just cara. The rules down there. Don't do anything stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. Baltar vai na polpa da lança, fica do lado da água por dois minutos, vai aparecer um Ozob e vai te puxar pra dentro da água. Se ligam nós e nariz de Ozob na live, manda um salve pra ele. O maluco que o BR comeu as vielas. Número Xbox. Porra, não entendi quase nada. Só do Ozob. You know how to use that? Uh, no, not really. You might want to just let it do its thing. Pô, maluco não sabe nem qual é o botão de power. É um imbecil, né? Caralho. O cara vai mexer na parada na tela que ele vai no power, desliga. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay. O2 check done. Whoa, 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 Eager Beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Eu nunca mergulhei, tem mó medo dessa porra, mano. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey, that's my sis you're talking about. You know it. Oh, hey, guys. What, Jesus, why are you so loud? I almost completely forgot. When I was looking at the dive cam, I saw this huge hole in the tail. Kablooey. That's your way into the plane. Oh, nice work, man. Thanks, Conrad. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Cara, o maluco não sabe nem mergulhar e meteu ele até uma faca do Rambo. Esse jogo tá escuro. Porra, aí fui olhar pro sub falando merda. Maybe we can fire it up again tonight for our private post dive special. Are you gonna bring your bang stick? That front cabin is gonna pop its portholes. Tá escuro o jogo?
Aí não peguei as paradas. Fui olhar o sub falando merda. Caralho, um tubarão, mano. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh and eager cabin boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Sure. Why not? Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? É uma longa história. Não pergunte a uma dama sobre o dinheiro dela. It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. Grata. Não, recentemente. Ela é ressentida, essa mulher. I built this business from scratch. I took out a loan on my boat and that's all the help I need. Thanks. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Duke of Milan. Weather looks clear. Hmm. I have to keep an eye on those clouds. Uh oh. It's getting mighty crowded out here. A mulher vai descalça. E aqui, tá aberto aqui agora. Entra aí, cara. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Desaprovador. Pega leve na bebida. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. Espero que saibam o que fazem. Você sabe. What do you know about this wreck? Just rumors and theories. I got tired of the speculation and wanted to see if there was actually anything there. Como você descobriu? So, how did you figure it out? Everyone was just looking at where the plane was headed. But I asked myself, where was the plane from? You know, where was that airbase? So I made some guesses based on that hypothetical return flight and I guess I guessed good. Velho imundo cara que você reagiu mais cedo tá na live. Dá um salve pra ela e seu velho lazarento. Calma aí. I just hope they respect the Qual cara? O Zob? They understand the rules. They get it. But I'm not sure how much that actually matters to Julia. Julia's got Alex wrapped around her little finger. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. 
Salve o caralho, vira Prime aí, Ozob. Ah, ele virou. Ele já é. Presta atenção no game aí, Ozob. Daqui a pouco eu vou matar os personagens todos, vocês vão ficar enchendo meu saco. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia. Aqueles merdinhas devem ter se afogado já. Já matei dois personagens, então. Vamos lá, conta um break. Hey there. How's it hanging? Hey there. How's it hanging? Relaxado, aproveitando. Você pode monitorar o mergulho. You can monitor the dive while I do some boat maintenance. Not a problem, Bob. Você está encalhado. Fala sério. I'm serious. You can't fuck around with this stuff, Conrad. Do it for real or don't do it. Yeah, totally. I got you. Serious. Riquinhos. Rich kids can just up and take a vacation whenever they goddamn please, I guess. Não posso falar com ele de novo? Howdy, Captain. How's the sea? Big and blue. And how's the sky? Brighter than you. Boom! Game set match. Uh huh. Hello again, little blip. What you doing all the way out here? Mm, não faz nada. Senta aí. Caralho. What's that about? Não é a guarda costeira, é um barco pesqueiro pela cara. That is not the coast guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? This feels off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? Caralho. Guys, you gotta keep back. We've got divers in the water. Caralho, quanto break. Caralho, quanto break. Caralho, retardadão, quanto break. Lerdão da conta um break. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. The turret. We can get in through there. Caralho, 
Caralho. Porra! Só uma cortadinha. Caralho. Good God. Mas cara, o que aconteceu aqui? Caiu o avião, né? Uh, Porra, quebrou a faca. O cara tá com a arma na mão, mano. Caralho, boa. Tô com susto, cara. Manguia. Pilot e co-pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. Cara, vai fazer merda, né? Será que eu não posso voltar para lá, não? Não, ali... Não tem nada. Pô, botaram uma mulher com a bunda magra, né? Bullets. Bullet holes, all down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. He's holding something. Ela não fala com o Lerdão, né? O 
Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. Shark, not interested in us. Let's go. Cara, vai comer a perna dele, mano. Uh, okay. I. Uh... What are you doing? Why are you fidgeting? Uh, I don't know. I, I. Wanted to bring something up with you, but it's it's not the best time. Cara, dentro d'água, filho. O que você vai fazer? Oh, you had something to raise with me, did you? It doesn't matter. Let's get back up to the top. Hey, seriously, what's going on? Nothing. Yeah, but you're freaking me out. Just. Forget it. I shouldn't have said anything. Come on. We've really got to get up top. Fliss, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Cara, acabou de ser comido por um tubarão num navio, num... Where did the boat come from? Wait. Julia. We got to decompress here. Whoa. Damn. What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. Temos que descomprimir. Meu irmão está lá em cima. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. My brother's up there. Julia, this is crazy. You just gotta wait a few seconds. Que isso, cara? Foda se eu vou. Just a few more seconds. Okay, now go, go. Hey, what the hell is going on? What the hell happened? It's cool, man. Everything's all right now. Oh, nothing. Your brother just took it upon himself to blow up my grill. Conrad, what is wrong with you? So, why are you paying the ocean? A group of fishermen came by and damaged their boat. Well, they got caught on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. So then uh, Ambassador Conrad figured the best move is to show him he'd rather throw away his money than give it to them. You're an asshole. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what you guys find? Well, we found the plane. And it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Unfortunately, we did not leave it as pristine as we could have. What? Why? The dive line, actually. How bad? Uh, there's no cockpit anymore, for starters. God. Well, that's just fucking perfect. É igualzinho. Quanto um, né? Quanto um não o. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, 
the love of Alex's life, and he the love of hers. What about Conrad, a bold fellow, you might say? Or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. You're doing well. Virem pra mim aí, porra! How well preserved was the plane? Pretty much what you'd expect. Brad, it was insane. It was like traveling through time. No shit. Well, it was like traveling through time and accidentally ending up in a dimension where the past is underwater and like everything is covered in barnacles and sharks. Sharks? It was a gray reef. Ah. Uh. Hey, I thought it was pretty intense. Wasn't Conrad gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Seriedade. Alex, you're like an open book with a 50-point font. I can read you from a mile away. Something's up. It's nothing. I'm oh, fine. Oh, bullshit. You're like Monsignor Mopington over here. Julia, are you happy? I mean, yeah, kind of. I think so. You think so? Or you know so? Is everything okay with us? Caralho. One of the things I love about you is how passionate you are. But Alex, you really, really have to quit being so sensitive and stop worrying about everything. Every relationship has rough patches. You just gotta talk about it. I guess I've just been worrying about things a lot lately. About us. Certeza. Look, when we get home, we can talk about some stuff, but relax. I mean, it's not like we're breaking up. It's just some stuff we gotta deal with. Okay. Yeah. Stuff. Stuff. I'm gonna go find Brad and Conrad and Fliss. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. So, which one is, uh, you know, where the magic happens? On behalf of my family, I'd like to apologize for my brother acting like a horny fifth grader. Ah, uh, it's okay. I can deal with children. Conrad, beers, where are they? Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. Procura aí time comando. Vê se o boneco não é igual o time comando. All right. Now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where did you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Pô, tá cheio de glitch gráfico, né? You seem kind of preoccupied. No, I'm good. Sorry. Didn't realize I was spacing out. So, does the accident mean we can't do any more diving? And let me just say this once more for the record. Going into that plane was super dangerous, obviously, and twice as illegal. Okay, now damage is done, so we just have to lie about it forever, or else we're gonna go to jail. Well, my list was suicide. So, we're going again tomorrow? Yeah, 
seemed a little too dangerous for my blood. Relax, Brad. How many times do I have to tell you not to be such a wuss? Uh, I'm gonna go find Julia. Hey, almost time for barbecuing. Got the pad yet? Sorry, I got distracted. No worries. Let's go get it. Got it. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. E caralho, mal taradão, mano. Listen, tiger. We should get back. Right here. You get no resistance there. All right, everyone. O Lerdão não bebe, não. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. You find anything else? This plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Game side. Oh, come on. No one knows we've even been down there. And I don't think ghosts can talk. You Americans are all the same, huh? No respect for anyone else's traditions. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Yeah, sure, but, you know, nothing like what Fliss is talking about. Tell us a tale. Vamos ouvir. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? Ah, well, down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards. And for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Seems legit. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Irritação. He of the one track mind. The woman answers. I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed down on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an axe. Que nojo. So gross. So gross. Okay, so who did it? The woman says, it was my husband. And she turns to the closet, says, he's in there. Ah, yes, the husband. And that's why I've always been a little weary of marriage. So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet, opens the door, and sure enough, there's a man inside, but he's cut his own throat. Horrified, 
He looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> yeah, it's so gross. Ah, hey, oh, super twist. Nossa, mano. <laughs> nice one, Squire. Isso era legal. You have me going. Pretty cool. I think you told it better last time. But good effort. Okay. You've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required. One more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? <laughs> uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, ma'am. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> and four good buddy. And I'm out. Aquele maluco sem olho vai pegar eles. Tempestade, mano. Nossa, mano. Caralho. Caralho. 